Hey, how's it going? I'm going to get right to the point. My name is Brad Smith. I help with automation stuff. And if you watch this video, I'm going to show you those first emails you should send to your new leads to get 80% open rates. That's what we do. We send automated emails all day, probably over 20,000 per day for all of our clients. In this video, I'm going to break down those first three emails. I want to get straight to the point and walk you through how we would set those up with my screen over here. But if you're new to my channel, comment new. It's great to have you. Let's get started. All right, so the first one I'm gonna show you here is the welcome email. That's the most important. You wanna be the inbox person, not the promo person. So that needs to be asking for a reply. Email number two that you're gonna set is gonna send the next day. And that's where you're gonna ask them to follow you wherever you're the most active at on social media. That's an extra follow-up so they don't forget about you. Email number three is telling them about maybe other services you offer. They might have come in for one thing, but if they see that you offer a few other things, something might spark their interest more. Email number one, two, and three should all be really personable, like you're sending them from your Outlook or your Gmail account. That's what's gonna help you make sure you hit the inbox. If you start adding images and more than three links, that's when you'll be flagged as a promo. All right, so let's dive in. So I set this very first one up and you wanna talk about maybe whatever they signed up for. They signed up for your newsletter, they signed up for your guide, whatever they signed up for on your website or your lead magnet, you wanna address that in the subject line so they know exactly who it's coming from. Because if they've never received an email from you, you wanna make this personal and make it stick out. So for me, somebody signed up, they wanna learn how to tell stories using automation online. So I say, hey, it's your brand, your story template. Here's the template that I promised you. Then I make sure it comes from me, brad-automation links. They may not know your name, they may not know your company name, but they might know one. So I like to combine those. So that way one of those may catch their attention based on where they signed up. From there, you wanna keep it short and to the point. You wanna give them what you promised them, give them that link so they can get to that training right away, but then ask a question. The goal here is to ask some sort of question to get them to reply. If they reply, awesome, you're gonna be in their inbox. And then I just give a little PS, make it personal, and boom, keep it short, to the point, get that reply. Then you're gonna wait a day because we don't want them to forget about you. So tomorrow, because what happens when somebody first signs up for something is they might be at a red light, they might be picking up their kids up from school, they forget, they don't have time to follow through with that full action. So we wanna make sure we send an email the next day. This is important, we wanna ask them to follow you somewhere on social media. This way they don't forget about you. So now that we want them seeing your emails and we want them seeing your social media posts. I give the exact breakdown of how I can help here and the entire strategy, value, value, value. And then I tell them to follow me on Twitter slash X. Hey, let's connect more on X so we can continue building that relationship and I can continue helping and coaching you. So that's really key. Think about where you're the most active, where you provide the most value on social media, get them to follow you there, then you'll always be top of mind. Email number three, I wait two days here. So we wanna wait another day. We wanna send email number three. And this is where you can start talking about other things that you offer, other services. So I offer automation, but we also help with automating social media, automating videos, automating emails. So maybe you're not interested in automating your ads, but you're interested in automating your social media. So you wanna share different services that might catch someone's attention. So if you can send these as personal as possible, add some bullet points, give them the link, give them what they promise, ask for replies, you will be the inbox person, not the promo person. All right, so what are you gonna do with this? I hope you implement this, try it in your business. I recommend using Go High Level for automated emails. You can have unlimited emails without them charging you more for the more emails you get. They allow you to send those plain text emails. You can find my affiliate link down below if you feel like it, if not, no big deal. Use it in your marketing system that you already have in place. And that's the key, make these first three emails personal. The more personal, the more you'll stay in the inbox. What's the point in emails if no one ever sees them? So if you start sending me emails with images, graphics, videos, GIFs, did I say GIFs right? GIFs, um, all these links, more than three links, you're gonna end up in my spam or my promo folder. I'll never see them, I'll never open it. Also, if you send me emails I don't recognize, let's say I signed up from something that you promised me with your name, but I'm only seeing your company name that I don't recognize, I'm not gonna open the email or vice versa. If I sign up with your company name and you're only sending me emails from your personal name, I don't know your name yet. So combine both names, your name and your business name in your from address. So I recognize who you are. I remember who you are. Use those subject lines to remind me of who you are, what I signed up for. And then from there, you can start building relationships 
with short, snappy, simple emails because I'm busy. Think about your customer. They're busy. They're driving. They're got family. They're doing this. They're doing that. They're trying to run a business, whatever they're at in their life, whatever type of business you have. Keep them short, snappy, quick. Reply or click the link. Keep it simple for them because you know that they're busy just like you. Do you want to read a really long email that tells you everything? Or you want to keep it short to the point where maybe you can come back tomorrow and read the rest. All right, if this video brought you any value, just subscribe to my channel so I can keep sharing more automation tricks like this. Thanks again for watching. I hope to see you on the next video.